CO2 reduction requires an evaluation how things are currently being produced and transported, and a search for alternatives that need less energy and materials to do the same thing. This is why reducing CO2 is considered to be complex. There is more than one answer to the question, how should we reduce CO2? Let's discuss a few ways you can get started on your CO2 reduction journey. First, switch to renewable source materials, recycled or durable materials with a long lifespan. This can support your move in reducing CO2, but should, you, should be done strategically. It's important to look at your application, the intended market, and how it will be used and what happens to it at its end of life. This assessment will help you determine whether renewable source or recycled materials is the best option. Second, reduce the weight of your products. When things are lighter, they use less energy. Consider a car. Cars today are made out of 12 to 15% or more plastics, replacing materials like metals and steel. This allows them to need less materials and energy to go the same distance. Third, reduce the total amount of waste generated. This can often be one of the easier approaches to tackle because it can be entirely managed at your production facility. The goal to, is to make the process of producing more efficient so that the production runs smoother and there's less scrap waste at the end of a production run. Lastly, to reduce energy consumption. Each method that we have discussed today are all considered strategies to reduce energy consumption. But there are many more, like switching to energy efficient light bulbs, repurposing the heat generated in production to heat your buildings, or using green energy produced with solar and wind power. CO2 reduction doesn't always mean materials are made from recyclable or renewable source materials and reduced weight, waste and energy. Reducing CO2 is simply having a lower carbon footprint than the current in-place materials or processes. So when viewed in that manner, tons of opportunities to improve sustainability practices and reduce CO2 carbon footprint gets available. Head to our Insight Library to learn more about what you can do to lower your CO2 outputs. And don't forget to subscribe for our newsletter to get the latest insights sent directly to you.